What a good boy! What a good boy! Look how you're getting in your car seat like a big boy. Sitting outside at a Starbucks by our favorite store. Costco's over there. I don't know, this baby is just kind of like super fussy and needy and clingy as of late. I think it's since he got sick, he's been just a little, I don't know, off. And I don't think he's fully recovered from having to we had to, you know, for a week be forcing medicine down his throat, then with hitting his mouth on the floor and having to go to the ER, and then more medicine for that. I just think, like, he had a rough, what was that, like? Week and a half? Yeah. 10 days, 10 to 12 days? 10 to 12 days, like week and a half, and I think just, he probably cried more that week than he has, whole like, life. his whole life, yeah. So, I just think that that, that 10 or 12 days kind of, like, changed. changed his little personality a little bit. So, I'm hoping that, like, if we string a few good, like, weeks together, that maybe he'll go back to right now. how he was. He to be held by you. Right now, he's, there's nothing wrong with him. He's just whinging on because he doesn't like to be away from Casey right now. He doesn't want me to hold him. He only wants Casey to hold him. And he'll do this until, until she drops him. Also, I think with his age, like, he's at the point now where he knows what he wants, but, like, he also doesn't have the ability to communicate that without, like, you know, whining or, like, pointing. So it's probably just a frustrating time in his life, you know? Which I'm sure doesn't help his, you know... Because he wants to be a boy, but he hasn't stopped being a baby yet. You know? Yeah. He has, he he's he's in that run. transition period. Yeah, he wants to run. He doesn't like to have his hand held when he's walking, but he can't walk <laughs> yet, you know? Not, not fully. He can do like 10 Yay! steps. But when he's walking, like he just wants to go so fast. He doesn't want to have to have his hand hold or go slow, you know? So it's just a frustrating time of life right now. Ever. Hopefully by Christmas time, you're in a better state and a little more developed. And Anyways, we're gonna go into Costco for a little bit, just a quick look around, and then probably head home so that he can take a nap, because that's really the only time that he's like, chill. Okay, okay, I'll hold ya. I'll hold the baby. We're at Costco now, our favorite store of all time. Maybe. Second, <coughs> second to Target. <coughs> what? This is the generator we're gonna get for the bus everything we need and it's powered by solar it's the goal zero 1000 lithium is either that or the 1500 we're gonna go for it's an awesome piece of kit it can power i don't know depending on the size of the solar panels and the sun you get it should just be solely from the solar two plug outlets four usbs 12 volts and then this is where you will plug in and this way you'll plug in this is source power this will be solar power which we'd probably be using but the next size we up you can charge separate batteries to it so this might be it and it's for thousand dollars here in costco now it has to be out <laughs> oh you see the face see that little puppy face Ladies and gentlemen, I'm getting ready to go to work. Casey's getting ready to go to work. The baby's going along with whoever's going to take him to work. Yeah, you, over there. Yeah. Yeah. Two more weeks of this craziness. Everything will be back to normal, roughly. Casey will just do the substituting. No more driving around. Like crazy people at two o'clock in the afternoon. Two more weeks, Casey, that's all. Yeah. Are you done with it or not? Or you don't really mind? Um, I don't really mind. <laughs> It'll be nice when it's over and the baby doesn't have to be like, Bodhi got some new toys. He got a birthday present that you see over there from one of my best friends, Brittany. And in that birthday present was this cool little like laptop, which he is like really into. Yeah. So I told her that we're flying to England for Christmas and I was like, either get him like winter clothes that he could wear over there or Tell him! Tell him! 
or something that like a toy that he could play with on the plane going over there because we have like three flights and one of them is 13 hours so and he's really just loving this toy so this is gonna disappear maybe like in a month or so so he'll forget about it and then I'll bring it back out on the plane and we're just eating some dinner. I'm eating an egg burrito. He's just having some mac and cheese. I won my volleyball game in three. We won the first game, lost the second game, won the third game. Then we stayed for JB and JB lost. And then we left after the first game of varsity because Bodhi was really tired. He was being really good, just hanging out. But you could just tell he was like getting antsy and sleepy. So we left after the first game. He fell asleep, pull ride home. And now we're up just eating our little last night. Last, last supper snacks before we go to bed. Chris is not gonna be home until late tonight, so we will not see him before we go to bed and I wake up from, I mean, I have work early in the morning, so I probably won't see him until tomorrow after I get off work. Hey, what's up? I have to be quiet. It's 9.35, it's very eerily, it's so quiet in the house right now. I don't know if you can hear us very well, but hello. It's so quiet in the house right now. I think everyone's asleep. I just got in from work. I'm gonna begin the edit. I don't know what's in today's vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, thumbs up, click subscribe, and we'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>